Hello beautiful souls, it's Karen at Soul Magic 99 and today I was guided to do one of my love letter readings which I haven't done for a while so this is a love letter reading from Divine Masculine to Divine Feminine so we're just going to check in with his current energies and see where he's at right now just want to thank you all for watching, liking, sharing, subscribing thank you for all your lovely comments I'm almost at the 2000 so thank you so much for that. I appreciate all your support and your comments. And if there's any other readings you would like me to do, please leave a comment down below. So now we're going to get on with your messages from your masculine. My dearest Divine Feminine, I just want you to know that I am looking for this solid security, this secure base with you. I really want this moving forward. I know it may not seem like it and maybe I've pushed it away in the past. But I want you. I want you in my life. I want us to build something solid together. I want us to go forward together in the world. Just you and me. Togetherness. Everything else seems like an illusion to me. Everything that's happened before I met you, did that even really happen? I'm trying to get my head sorted right now, to get the truth, to be clear. I'm moving away from the past. I'm leaving the past behind me. I'm leaving all that unhappy times, those disagreements. Even with you, I want to leave it behind. I want us to start afresh with a clean slate, if you'll let me. I know I need to make that decision and to tell you, you know, I'm really working on this to be clear in my head before I come forward. But know this, I have so much passion for you. So much passion. And I want to communicate with you and I want to move forward in this connection. Because at first I thought this passion was just like a lost connection. But it's lasted so long, it's never ending. I want you to know that you tempt me. I think about you often. I find you so desirable, so luscious, so feminine, so tempting to my soul. I want us to have balance in our lives and I'm working on that in myself right now and I guess you are as well. You know, maybe I was too much in my masculine and I'm trying to work on that and get more in touch with my feelings and really go deep with my feelings which is a scary thing for me but I'm really trying right now please believe that because I want this stability with you I want this foundation with you I want this loving secure home life with you that is what I'm desiring right now to me you're so beautiful you're stunning but not just the way you look the way your soul is, the way your heart is, the way you are in the world. I know that you look after yourself, you're a healthy person and I respect that about you. I know you're a seeker in life, you look for answers, you question everything and you're not afraid to go in new directions and again I really admire that about you. I know you're balanced. You're balanced in your emotions and your energies. I can feel that. I can feel that in our 5D connection. I see you juggling a lot of things in your lives and I, I don't know how you do it. And again, I really admire that about you because I find it hard to focus on one thing sometimes and you're so amazing to me. You are the Empress. You are my Divine Feminine. You're loving, you're nurturing, you're in your power. I can feel it right now. I want us to bring out that inner child in each other. I want us to have that youthful, fun energy with each other again. To really make each other laugh, to have that fun together. We both deserve a bit of fun, a bit of happiness in our lives. You are such a sexy person to me though. 
you're so sexy and you overwhelm me with your sexuality at times. You're so confident in your sexuality. And I know that this is more than sex, it's love. And I do love you. I do. I want you to know that I am on my way to you. Please don't lose hope, okay? I'm coming. Please look for the signs. I'm sending you signs. I'm sending you messages on the 5 day. Listen to your intuition, listen to your heart. What is it telling you about me? I know it's time for me to be brave. And it's time for you to be brave. We need to be brave and go forward together in this connection. I have such sweet memories of the time that we shared. And I want to make so many more memories with you. I know that you have clairvoyance. And maybe I have this gift as well, but I'm scared to look, I guess. And you see so many things about me that I've not told you. You, you feel it or you'll see it somehow. And it's a bit scary sometimes. But I want us to have that sacred union. I want us to commit to each other. I want us to have the deep relationship that I think you've always wanted. You exude such confidence. You have this charisma. You're so glamorous. It overwhelmed me. And I know you have such great intuition and I'm using to learn my, I'm learning to use mine. I'm learning to trust it, to trust it and really work with it right now. I want us to have new adventures together. I want us to travel together. I want us to meet our destiny together. You are such a nurturing person, you are so wise, and you've shared knowledge with me, and you are such a good teacher to others, and it's such a warm, loving energy to be around, and I miss that. I've been doing my healing right now, and I guess you may have been healing as well. I've really wanted to heal myself, to really work on those issues that I know I need to work on. You are such a gentle power about you. I don't even know if you realise this. There's something about you. You're powerful, but not in a horrible, bossy way. It's gentle. It's a gentle power. I guess it's that divine feminine energy. And I know we've been silent. We've not communicated. But there is information in the silence. If you listen in the silence, you will hear my heart. You will hear my messages to you, heart to heart. I want us to be whole again. I want us to be together. I want this rebirth of this connection more than anything. I really want this. I've been very, very sensitive to the moon energies. The power of the moon really makes me go deep, makes me go within and I connect. I connect with my feelings and I also connect with you there, that feminine energy. I connect with you there. There's such attraction between us. I just cannot resist you. And I'm accepting about this connection now. I tried to deny it for so long. I tried to think it was something else, but I've accepted what it is. It is that soul connection we have, a deep, deep soul connection. And I want to join you on the path. I want to join you on this path, wherever it may take us. And I want to do the walk along this path with you as, as a couple. And I want our relationship to blossom to blossom into its full potential and to see you blossom into your full potential. And I know in the past I've been extreme in my reactions. I've been passionate, desiring you, wanting you in a sexual way. 
but I wasn't there for you emotionally. And then I ran. I put a distance between us. I put silence between us. And all I can do is apologise. I was confused. I was in a fog. I didn't understand. I didn't understand myself and I didn't understand what was happening to me. I want you to know I have more focus now. And I know I've been ascending. I know I've been raising my vibration. I've been working on my energy. And I have more focus now about what it is I want moving forward in my life. I want to be your divine masculine. I want to be that strong, wise, dependable masculine. The one that you rely on. The one that supports you. That raises you up when you're low. And I know that I've had to do some inner child work. And you probably have as well. And maybe we both were in the same boat. We didn't get the love we wanted or needed as a child. But I'm working on that for myself. I'm loving myself now. And I'm sure you are as well. And know this. I am nurturing and loving myself in the best way that I can. And I've realised I'm worthy of love. I am worthy of your love. I am deserving of your love. And you are worthy of my love. And we are both worthy of this love, this con commitment, this twin flame union. We are worthy of this. We are soulmates. I know this. We made a connection many, many, many lifetimes ago. And we've met over again, over again to learn soul lessons together, in love, out of love, in connection, out of connection. I've had some flashbacks, I've had some visions of some of our other lives, but we're in the here and now, and I want to put it right, I really do. I want to make that commitment to you, I hope you realise I'm genuine, and I do really mean this. You are my other half, you are my missing part of me, and I want to be with you. Because you deserve love. You are so lovable. And I know that I deserve love as well. And I am lovable. And together we can love each other. Just decide if you really want me to come forward. Just have that set, clear intention in your mind. And I will come to you soon. I will come to you very soon. Just use the moon energy. Work with that moon energy. And call me in. Yes, call me in. I am your soulmate. Pray. Use affirmations and visualizations to call me back in. I am doing this. I am doing this from my side. So do it from your side as well. I want us to have that playful energy to recapture romance between us. As I said, that playful, innocent, childlike energy of fun and just shine in each other's company. I want us to really get to know each other in all ways. I want you to reveal everything to me and I will to you. We will share our good and our bad because I want us to be close, as close as anyone can be. I want us to have that emotional, sexual intimacy because I want to reconcile with you. I want you to know this. I want to come back. I want to come back and start again in this connection. So expect a message. It may not be in the physical, but it may be in the telepathic, in the 5D. I'm going to send you a message. Listen out for it. You've enchanted me with your beauty, with your soul, with the light that shines within you. I'm enchanted with you. We are reflections of each other, I know this now, the good and the bad, and we trigger each other, but it's really enabled us to heal and grow, and I'm really working on myself right now. You are such a blessing to me, I realise it now, I'm so grateful for meeting you no matter what happens, you are a true blessing in my life, please realise that. And I do believe in miracles because, again, you're a miracle to me that you even exist. Somebody that I couldn't even imagine existed. And I want us to be together again and I plan to believe in a miracle that we will be. 
because this is true love. I've never felt this way about anyone else because this is soul love, deep love. And I know like attracts light and I'm working on my vibration and I'm working on being the loving person you deserve. I'm working on opening my heart to love again, to give and receive love. And I'm working on myself, my self-care. I'm resting, I'm relaxing, I'm going within. I'm really taking care of myself and I hope you are too because you deserve a break. I want us to build that foundation. I want you to know I'm committed to building this love connection between us. I know this, my actions, actions speak louder than words and I can say anything to you but unless I follow up with action do I mean what I'm saying and I understand why you question this but I will express my love through actions I don't know how yet but I will trust me I'm so excited to see you again and I really hope you give us a chance of this new beginning I want us to celebrate our love, to have fun, to have laughter together, to live in the moment. I know when you met me I was a player. I wasn't looking for love. It took me by surprise and I'm sorry if I treated you badly. I had a lot of growing to do. I want to be sensual with you, please you in every way. I want to be open-minded in our sexual connection. I want to express myself in all ways with you. But as I said, I want to build this firm foundation first. Build this firm foundation, really build it so that it's solid and it's not going to topple over and allow it to blossom and grow the way it should have done in the first place. I want to explore you in every way, your mind, body and soul. I want us to have a family. I want us to create a family together. I really hope we get that blessing. I want us to live together, have a home together, have a fresh start, just you and me. I want to be romantic, like take you dancing in the park. Just be that knight in shining armour for you that you so deserve. I want to marry you one day. I love you. I know we're so different. But the chemistry is so on fire. You make me feel alive like no one else and I'm de burning with desire. Everything about you turns me on. Just the way you look, your smile. Even if you get cross, it still makes me smile. And when I think of you, my heart glows as your love has truly got under my skin. Forgive me, I want us to be able to talk. Please, let's clear the air. I'm sorry, my love. I projected this hurt onto you. You have done nothing but love me. It's not you. I've dated other women, but they're not like you. They are dull and boring. I want us to. Would you believe this? When I looked in your eyes, I saw a past life flashback. With my divine partner, we'd be a team. And we were problem solved together without judgment or blame. I will work with you as a team. And I call on the divine to really bring together this sacred union. And I trust everything will happen according to divine will. I open up and allow myself to receive love from my divine partner, even when it feels scary. The sound of your voice does something to me. It soothes my soul, but it also turns me on so. I cannot stop thinking about you. It's like you've taken over my brain. Sacred union is what I want. True spiritual connection. Endless love. My love is yours until the end of time. This love transcends space and time. It truly is a timeless love.